All right, guys, so this is a 250 horsepower liquid-cooled electric motor. This was brought to our shop because we were told that it had bearing vibration noise. Let's point out a couple things and then we're gonna test run it. So we have our inlet and we have an outlet for our liquid cooling. We have our power or our connection hookup right here. This thing also has three sensors on each side of the winding to measure temperature and that it also has temperature sensors that are monitoring the bearing temperature as well. The shaft spins freely. I don't hear any bearing noise. So let's get this thing on a table and test run it. We're gonna use a VFD or a variable frequency drive to power this motor. So what we're doing is we're controlling the frequency which gives us the ability to control the speed itself. So we can start it slow and slowly ramp it up. This motor is 480 volts. It'll pull up to 282 amps and it will go from zero to 80 hertz. So that's 20 hertz over our standard 60 hertz that we would normally operate which increases our 1800 four pole RPM speed up to 2400 RPM. You can hear that as soon as we start to approach around the 15 hertz range that this thing starts vibrating like crazy. As soon as we cut the power to the motor, you'll hear that that noise goes away. So this means that we do not have a mechanical bearing issue. We have an electrical issue. And now we're going to need to get the go ahead to open it up to see what's inside. Cheers, guys.